the tropical storm is forecast to turn into a Category 1 hurricane made over the Gulf of Mexico before smashing into the U.S. coast this weekend. Tropical Storm Nate is bearing down on Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula after killing at least 22 people in Costa Rica, Nicaragua and Honduras. The NOAA National Hurricane Center NHC puts the eye of the storm on track to hit Louisiana near New Orleans, the city ravaged by Hurricane Katrina. The latest tracking map shows that Nate will make first landfall in Louisiana and second landfall in Mississippi near the Alabama border. The court, which contains the probable path of the eye of the storm, shows that Nate could hit anywhere between Louisiana and the Florida Pan Handle. The NHC's 5 a.m. BDD update said, Nate is forecast to reach the northern Gulf Coast late Saturday or Sunday morning as a hurricane, and the threat of direct impacts from wind, storm surge, and heavy rainfall is increasing from Louisiana through the western Florida Pan Handle. Hurricane and tropical storm watches, as well as a storm surge watch, are in effect for a portion of the northern Gulf Coast, and residents in these areas should monitor the progress of Nate, heeding any advice given by local officials. Nate is still battering Central America as it moves away from Honduras towards the Yucatan Peninsula, the next place at risk. Life-threatening flash floods and mudslides are forecast in parts of Nicaragua, Honduras, Costa Rica, Panama, and Belize through tonight. The NHC said, on the forecast track, the center of Nate will move across the northwestern Caribbean Sea today, and reach the eastern coast of the Yucatan Peninsula early this evening. Nate will then move into the southern Gulf of Mexico tonight and approach the northern Gulf Coast Saturday evening. The Hurricane Center added, there is a possibility that Nate could be near hurricane intensity when it approaches the Yucatan Peninsula later today bringing direct impacts from wind, storm surge, and heavy rainfall.